Fasten your seat belts because Gerard Butler and Mike Coulter are coming together in plane to make your weekend even more exciting. In an exclusive interview with Weon's entertainment editor, uh, Bria Dai, who spoke to the actors who are starring in the movie, which is out in theatres near you. Listen in. Welcome to Weon, Gerard and Mike. Thank you. I just want to ask you this. There are two kinds of people in this world, one who reaches airport three hours early and the one who is rushing towards security last minute. Which one are you guys? I'm rushing to security last minute for sure because <laughs> I, I got a time down. I'm just before the doors close. Yeah, me too. I'm never in time for a flight. I'm always sitting in the car going, why? Why did I do this? Why didn't I just go? But, but if I'm in the house and I'm early, I don't feel comfortable to leave. I have to wait till the adrenaline gets going. And then my driver's like, oh my God, swinging through traffic. And, yeah, silly. We're both so idiots. So how many flights yeah. have you guys missed? Only two in my life. Uh, I've missed a few more. <laughs> I once was at the airport and missed three flights in a row, Ooh. even at the airport. Oh my God. I, I, that hasn't happened for a long, I don't know. Don't well, fell asleep for one. I went the oh, wrong way. Oh, that. Oh, that yeah. wants to happen it was like, at the gate. are you kidding I, I forgot about, so three for me at the gate. I was. It was early and I fell asleep at the gate. I remember that. Right, yeah. right. That needs special talent. Yes. Well, we're very talented <laughs> yeah, in, in all the wrong ways. In the film, we see you guys are together in mostly all the frames. So I'm guessing you have spent a lot of time with each other while the shoot is happening. So tell me one interesting thing you discovered about each other during the filming of this film. <laughs> wow. <laughs> interesting thing. Look, we provide something interesting that I can... There is nothing share. interesting about me for him to find out. No, it's not an interesting thing. I just want to share his business. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's a good point. Yeah. I'm already going, oh, no, can't say I can't say that. that. Oh, can't say that. Uh, he's a mummy's boy. Oh, yeah. He's a big oh. Yeah. He's, uh, oh, yeah. That's speaking of that. So his his mother is the only person that calls him Jerry. Yes. <laughs> That's the only. Yeah. yeah. Everyone else calls him Jerry. Yeah. Everybody else calls me Jerry, except uh, and my mom. That's the other thing. When Americans say Gerard, I, I, it's like my mom getting me out of bed when I yep. was a kid. I'm like, oh, sorry. Oh. <laughs> so. So he would call me Gerard as much as he could to annoy me. <laughs> I tried to say Jerk, Jerk, but I couldn't say like his mom probably. Jerk, Jerk. <laughs> Sounds no, good. Pretty good. By the way, you're see in in America the the emphasis is on the second, second syllable, so they go Gerard. Yeah. Yes. And in Scotland and India they go Jerk. Yeah. So Get the it. emphasis on the first vowel. Yes. So it, you're you're more like the the Scottish, and that was oh, good. Wow, amazing. Good. I'm, I'm practicing. I'm practicing. <laughs> like a year and a half. Okay, Jared, this question is for you. We have seen few videos that, you know, you know how to fly. So I'm guessing that when you sat in the cockpit, which is not a real cockpit, you were like, oh my God, I know this. I know all the functions, right? No. You know all of that? I've flown um, a few small planes, um, but I would say, you know, those small planes have maybe, you know, 20 gadgets. They, these commercial airliners have about 600 gadgets. So. You know, Indian films like RRR and Last Film Show are making their presence felt globally. Have you guys seen it? I have not, but I, I'm going to. I'm going to see because we. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a guy that likes to watch foreign films a lot, and I just haven't had a lot of time to watch anything because I have two young kids and I'm just completely, you know, busy working and stuff. But I love, like, I've been watching the Indian films since Monsoon Wedding, which you probably oh, yeah. remember, it's so long ago. But but I, I keep an eye on foreign films because they're so much, they're so different from American films. They just have a different take on life and they focus on things we normally don't focus on. So I will check those films out, I promise you. And this, I, I, I haven't seen RRR yet, but I've seen a couple of different trailers and I, and I can't wait to see it. It looks insane. Like from every aspect, you know, like the, the action, the lore, you know, the mythology, and then funny as hell as well. It just seems to have encapsulated everything. And, and there's a great buzz about it. It's actually, it's been very interesting that it's getting a lot of respect here. I'm reading a lot of like the, the top films of the year. And a, a lot of people are, are speaking very highly of it. And I, as you know, I have a big attachment to India. So that makes me very, very happy. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for talking to us. And I can't wait to see you guys in any Indian film, maybe dancing. Make it happen. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.